Hello and welcome back to Dragon Quest XI. When we last left off, we were getting ready to go face a horde of monsters. So I think choosing the zombie bane was actually a really good idea because if I am remembering correctly, um, everything that's coming at you is undead. So just elixir and a perfect panacea. Um, recruit. They say you made it all the way to the last bastion under your own steam. Well, I'm impressed, I've got to tell you. You can obviously handle yourself there, or you were born lucky. Well, either way, I'm sure we can find a use for you. Follow me. Because nobody actually knows right. who you are. Right, here's your spot. Just face that way, and when the monsters come, stick the pointy end of your sword in them. <laughs> oh, don't look so worried. You'll be fine. It's actually you I'm worried about. <clears throat> you don't get to be mad at me. Forces! Here they come! And here we go. Ah. So not all of them are undead, but a lot of them are, it seems. on you. Jack between the two. Hang on. Um Yeah, I, I know. Um Oh 
Okay. So I wanted to check. It's about the same. It looks to be about the same. Um, uh, items, item bag. Not doing anything else. Zombies bed back on. Okay. Uh let's get rid of the skeleton first because I think Does a little more. There's a ghoul. Yeah, in the grand scheme of things, I might actually just go back to using the uh, the the um, falcon blade. Yeah, it's a little weaker technically, but. seems to hit just a little bit harder for some odd reason.
first things first. Oh. It's everything on the field. Hit boom more one more time, and that should get rid of. And now we're dealing with just the head. Give ourselves a heal. I also kind of prefer the Falcon Blade because it doesn't, while you may not always connect with both attacks, you get at least one in. And there we go. Commander, a message from His Majesty. He wishes to speak with you. Both of you. Right away. I find it interesting that Hendrik continues to be leery of you and seem to have a severe amount of distaste for you, despite the fact that he has seen what's actually going on. Um, like, Hero has every reason to dislike. I don't think the same can be said of the adverse. Okay, let's go. Let's go talk to the king. Let's go talk to her mother. a debt of gratitude. You have proven your strength and your ability to work together. It is time. Time to bring light back to this benighted land. The fiend that usurped my throne must be ousted. Heliodor Castle must be reclaimed. And you, my loyal servants, must lead the charge. Now, I wouldn't call myself a loyal servant. But, but, sire. I do not give these orders lightly, Hendrik. My spies have found a means by which we might gain an advantage. 
the city sewers can be entered from the cliffs in the side of the hill atop which Heliodor stands. You will use these sewers to infiltrate the castle from beneath. Hmm. <laughs> yep. This key will unlock the gate. But sire, who will command our forces in my absence? If the enemy renews the attack, we will be slaughtered. We will not. We will be prepared. Prepared to draw them out, leaving the castle unguarded. The usurper must be overthrown while we have the chance. We strike now, or we never see the light of day again. Please, your majesty. We cannot allow yet more lives to be lost. Precisely. Which is why you must quell the darkness at its source. We seize our one opportunity, or we consign ourselves to despair. It is as simple as that. <coughs> or do you question the wisdom of your king? I mean... My subjects have shown me the depth of their courage. I trust in their ability to endure this one last assault. And I order you to do likewise. <laughs> you are our last hope. Do not let us down. If anybody has any reason to doubt, it would be Hero. If anyone has right to their trepidation. If anyone has right to their ire, it is Hero. Because they have been through the ringer and then some. So, let's make sure we've got everything that we need, and then we'll head out to Heliodor. Hendrick is going to need a better sword, I think, than what he has. That's tempting. I'm not spending that much. Uh, let's get Durka. Oh, we're gonna have to go back. I didn't see that the uh, item shop had, had moved back. Still say. With everything. That hero has every right to be suspicious and upset. Will he be? Probably not. But, uh. Bought a holy talisman already. Yeah, no, there's just nothing worth buying. 
Okay. Uh, and I think it's going to stay like that for a while, unfortunately. So let's head off and get the show on the road. Save again. Despite everything, again, I will be keeping the. I will be keeping the uh, pocket sword, as opposed to um, equipping the zombie bang because it seems to. I don't know. It seems to hit a little harder. Sir, I couldn't have a quick word with my boy, could I? I won't be long, I promise. As long as it is quick. Oh. So you're heading off again, are you? Hmm. Well, just you be sure to listen to Sir Hendrick and do as you're told. And don't you dare go giving up, ever. Just look at me, eh? Something's wrong with my eyes now, too. Must be all this squinting in the dark. Well, only one remedy for that. You'll just have to bring back the light. Promise? Hmm. Hmm. Time is short. We must be on our way. You'll look after my boy, won't you, Sir Hendrick? Hmm. Obsidian, see the lady back to safety. Oh. Okay, so Kendrick technically isn't a part of your party yet. Oh. You can't have a priest here, but, you know, you can have something. I doubt you can actually... you can. Okay. Uh... The gentleman at the item shop. Mm. Yeah, they they don't have anything. Okay. So our goal. Is getting to the Heladorian sewers. I'm also gonna grab whatever this is right here. Oh. 
I will eventually fight all of these. I don't know. I still don't know if I've decided whether or not I'm going to try and finish off the, uh, the bestiary. But I'm going to try my absolute damnedest to Seems like all there's to be had is that fatalistics. I don't know what they do though. Go around everybody. Could it be? Yeah, yeah, we kind of have to hope that the dragon is asleep. Which apparently you can fight? Uh, apparently it is actually possible with a whole lot of luck and a whole lot of patience to fight the dragon and beat it, and I guess you get a little bit of dialogue out of it, but other than that, I don't imagine there's much to it. I've not seen it myself, and I've not tried it myself. So, the assault begins. Move! This is no time for idling. Actually, that is where we're going to call it for today. So I have been Dorkno, this has been Dragon Quest XI, and we come back, we're going into the dank dark sewers. And if you've been enjoying these videos, consider a subscribe, and uh, if you like this one in particular, consider giving it a like. Uh, it really helps me out. Uh, but until next time, goodbye.